morning you guys we are loaded up 7 50 in the morning on a friday about to head out to purtis creek state park i live right beneath the airport in dfw and it says it's about an hour and a half a little over an hour and a half east of here southeast of here so we're going to go give it a shot and get out in the morning rush hour traffic for all these yahoos that are going to the job we are going camping all right so we're here so far the lake or the place is really nice man the lake is nice it's calm it's got a lot of fish in it from what they were saying successfully we have secured enough for a little area for two tents and even a big family size one in the back plus a trail that should i'm about to go check this out in a minute a trail that should go down there to the water we go look at that too and we got a picnic table we got a grill kind of a little ways away from the tent spot uh gigantic dead tree that's kind of cool hang ups for your lanterns and we do have water and we do have electricity but really good wooded spot man a lot of shade you're not going to overheat in the summertime out here so yeah the trail i was mentioning earlier followed it right out the back of the camp and it's just shooting it takes you right to the water's edge uh imagine this is a really shallow side uh, you can see people have already been fishing down here because there's already lures in the water. But it doesn't look too shabby, man. This is probably a really, really shallow side. Sandy bottom, like I was saying earlier. Um, we do have this fairly large snail. And that dude, that's nice. The uh, bathroom, shower point area. Uh, they have a coke machine and we picked site 27 and site 27 is literally like a 500 foot walk through the trail or through the woods on a trail to get here so you can come up here and whack yourself out with some unhealthy sodas all day in the hot sun but very well kept place uh doesn't you know have that typical latrine outhouse smell to it and uh in the back there's a little amphitheater and all these little trails connect to campsites back here in the back. So that's pretty convenient. You're not even a two or three minute walk from your site to come up here, go to the bathroom, and get cleaned up. Taking a stroll back here to uh, the fishing pier. Which is right around the corner from where we camped. It is really, really nice. A little windy today perfect temperature storms came through last weekend so the ground's a little damp things are drying out but all in all is this is pretty sweet not too hot not too cold it's supposed to be like this for i think 80 degrees today and tomorrow sunny clear skies no clouds not a lot of people out here yet of course it is early it's only like 12 31 o'clock uh, so I'll get out here, check this out, get a little bit more footage, and uh, see what this fishing pier is all about. Plenty of parking. You could probably put about 15, 20 vehicles down here. They got a bait shop in town in case you need anything. A lot of lizards and animals and wildlife. Trails all over the place. Very well clean and kept park. Even a place to clean your fish. Look at there. That's nice. Got the rules for fishing, what you can and can't take. When the trail opens up and you have a large, there's another pier down there.
Look at that. That's just, that's beautiful, man. A couple of ducks out there, but they keep the place really, really clean and mowed. There's a guy going around mowing the grass today. Yeah. It's good. Thank you.